This video of mine turned out pretty good. So I re-edited it. So I re-edited it for TikTok and found a few really useful tips and tools for repurposing long form content into shorts. Upload your video to the timeline. Normalize the audio levels. Now I'll cut from here and delete the last part because I'm not going to use it in this short. By the way, the shortcut for zooming into your timeline instead of pressing on this button is Shift and Z. Then go to timeline and click on detect scene cuts. This automatically cut your clip. Now the rule here generally is to remove everything that's a filler. Only stuff that is visually stimulating or it helps with the story progression. Everything else you gotta cut. Then go to the cut tab and let's switch it to portrait mode. Then go to custom timeline settings and here from scale entire image to fit, scale full frame with crop. For clips where you have a person go into the inspector smart reframe and then auto and this will center and follow your subject on clips like this you can manually reposition it or with the smart reframe choose reference point and choose what exactly do you want it to follow now for some instances like here you would need the clip to be a little zoomed out so you can see the full picture something that's built in in resolve is called blanking fill double click to apply it then go into the inspector and under source set the left and right crop to zero deselect the same top if you have any differences because here in this specific uh, situation I just wanted to, to crop it a little bit on the top. Under drop shadow, play around with these sliders here, for example, bump up the blur. It looks better. Then there are scenes where you're talking. You would want to add captions. Hit X on your keyboard and it will select an area. Then go to timeline, create subtitles from audio. I have a full video on that if you need explanation for these and then create. Just like that, you got yourself some subtitles. Go to the inspector here under track. You can customize them. And if you want to animate your captions, I have a video on that so you can check it out. Then it's time to go to the delivery page. Here you have to name your video, set a location here under format set it as mp4 leave it as h.264 on the quality i will leave a link down in the description for a calculator for your bit rates and one really important thing is to go under subtitle settings and check the export subtitles option because if you don't do it you will have no subtitles then hit on add to render queue and render all and those are my tips guys for making a long form video into a short TikTok, Instagram reel, whatever. If you saw anything you didn't know or if it was helpful at all to you, I would highly appreciate it if you subscribe and I'll see you in the next one.